Hello there, just a quick push. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe today. It costs you absolutely nothing. This is a non-monetized hobby channel and I do this purely, purely for the love of gaming. Thank you for your support. So, onto the game itself, onto the game. We're playing Octomaze today, and you know this because you clicked on the title. If not, how? How did you get there? Well, this game is very cheap. This game is extremely cheap. Basically, for less than a couple of bags of these, and this is just simple crisps, you could hopefully have a lot of fun here. These are fun to eat, but this game is certainly going to be fun to play. So, let's see what we've got here from uh, Octagon Gaming Studio, or up to Octagon Gaming Studio, or apologies, apologies, we have this game that's available on Steam. Now, if you have a, a look there, yeah, it's been out for a little while, and it hasn't got many reviews, but I did a little bit of research on this. I believe back in 2021, the mobile version of this game came second in an indie competition. I believe that's correct. Anyway, the authors of this game reached out to me. They reached out to the gentleman's picks club and said, hey, you know, would you mind playing our game? Yeah, of course I'll play your game. Let's go on to the journey. Let's see what this game is all about. So here we go. We've got background music, background sort of subtle music here that is quite peaceful. So one of the pause of types of games like this and maybe things like Tiny Wings and stuff like that is the music. You know, if you can have beautiful type music in the background, it makes you want to play a little bit more. We have not played at all. We've got zero gold coins and we can go into the shop here and basically nothing has been unlocked there at all and these are your octopuses or octopi or, or what have they what have they called here um generally they have two eyes these versions have only got one um and you'll see the one i used on the title card had two eyes because i use ai to generate these and oh holy hell trying to get it to draw an octopus with one eye even to the point of draw a ball and put an eye on it a cyclops eye and put tentacles on it eight tentacles for legs it came out with horrible mishmashes of things that we never ever want to see with our eyes again so let's start this game anyway let's close the shop close the shop now this is meant to be a puzzly type game i really don't know how to play it so i'm probably going to butcher this to start off with but you know i'll get the hang of it in the end so we we'll click on one here tutorial yes okay let's play so we've got to collect all the coins and there's either a, a, a octopus tentacle go there or um, something that we probably don't want to describe on this channel that's growing to collect the coins as well. You make your own mind up. So how do we do this? How do we do this? All ah, right. Okay. So this little tells us, this tells us that basically the octopus is going to come out here and we drag it around and collect all these. Right. So down we go. This is a puzzle game, by the way. Okay, yep, yep, yep. There we go, and we got it. Level one completed, three stars. Um, unlike the game that we played recently, where I had to do, it was a Boulder Dash clone, and basically I had to collect carrots. I wasn't very good at that. I seem to be a little better at this one, and can get past level one. All right, new one loading in. Don't touch enemies. Okay, so the, these these things are called enemies. I had a look at these. Um, basically, in reading the description, these are called parasites. So, you know, the, 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 these are your next door neighbor. If you live with houses nearby you that play music very loud all hours of the night with the windows open. And on the days they've got the windows closed, they're outside in their garden having barbecues and making a lot of racket. Those are parasites. Okay, so don't touch enemies. All right, we can do this. So we've got to get to the silver coin. So down here, we know obviously that that hand is going to disappear at some point. There we go. Level two done. Okay, so don't touch enemies again. Aha, now, now it gets tricky. All right, so we go here. Oh, and you can go back. You can go back on yourself as well. All right. Okay, good, good, good. So that's done as well. So we're just mo moving through here. Don't touch spikes. Right, okay. Where do I, where do I click? Oh, I click down there. All right, so these are spikes. Oh, look, they move. Why would you do that? All right, so let's do the easy stuff first. Turn. Oh no. Out of the way. 
all right, we're gonna wait that for, for that to go round again. We're gonna wait that for go round, and we we, we we don't want to upset this guy because he looks pretty angry at the best of times. So we're gonna hurry down to the bottom. Get that, and boom! And you see, it gives you the squares. It lights up the squares that are potentially dangerous for you. So press buttons to open doors. All right, I guess we've got to get to that button. We're gonna to go to that one first because it was lit up. Then we're gonna to go to the, oh no, nope, that one. Then that one. Then that one. This is just building all the elements of the level together to teach you what you could do, and it's gonna throw it all at once, I suspect, in one unholy challenge. All right, don't touch poison. All right. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, you know what? That reminds me. They remind me of the pigs from Angry Birds. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. There we go. We did that. We did that one all right. Yes. Oh. All right. Holy hell. All right. So we've got to touch buttons. Look at that one. It looks over to them. Okay. This is quite hard. Oh no, can't drag. Oh, it's all about timing. That was poor, that score. You know, 20 seconds it wants us to do it in. All right, so we got to touch buttons. Oh, he got sent sent back to Tentacle Land. Oh no, it's all the way round. I was trying to get through these little wall bits, but no, you got to go all the way round. Oh, why did it? Oh, hang on. What is going on here? Why does it flip like that? Uh, okay, interesting. flipping around dear god another game early on it's not going my way do you have to hold them I wonder uh oh alright I think I see if I let go of the mouse, it's game over. No, that's not it. By game over, it, it scrolls back. Oh, oh dear lord. Alright, so this is where using a mouse compared to a touch screen is a, a little bit different. Hmm. Or is it the top one? Hang on. Ah, I think we go top, down, then down. All right, let's try. Oh, there just wasn't enough time to get round. Oh, shit sticks. This is hard. Ha <laughs> ha. All right, this is going to be one of those frustrating games. I wonder, can we use the joystick? Does the joystick work? No. Right, so this is a mouse game. This is a mouse game. Hmm. 
Yes, haha, <laughs> we got one of you. Holy hell. All right. So it's wrong in that pattern. Okay. Okay, so we've got to go up. We've got to reverse what we did. We have to reverse what I did with this angry pig like character that's letting off bad smells. Oh, we did it, we did it, we did it. Oh, oh look, 3 minutes 48. I'm so sorry. All right, let's go again. All right, so no smell, so this is okay. No, you touch them and it's instant gone. Oh, there's one more. There was one more, I'm, ah, damn it. I like the background music, I like the graphics. I actually like quite a lot about this so far. It's hard, it's hard, it is hard to use the mouse, but you'll get the hang of it. And I noticed that it can sort of make its own little bit of pathing, if that makes sense. Um, so let me try and explain. So I'm gonna drag out. Uh, and I, I didn't click up there, that was me moving um, effectively to the right, and it did it. But look at this, oh, holy hell. Oh, that could kill us. Oh, this is going to be a horrible timing thing. Can we stop those from turning permanently? Yeah, they can't turn anymore because we're in the way. All right. Oh, sweet holy hell. Oh, no. Oh. Come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, damn it, that got me. That one got me here. All right, let's try again. So you can sort of block them from turning by holding your purple-headed tentacle ferret um, as, you, as, you, as you move along the journey. There you go. So there you go. Those are not going to move because I'm in the way. Right now, that's not going to move again because I'm in the way. And I've blocked that one from moving. Oh, shit sticks. Why did that move? I thought I blocked that one. And that is this one I was talking about here. What is the secret source why some stay blocked and some don't? Because look, this guy here, that one there that I'm touching while keeping the mouse button held down just is not turning. trying to get up and round. Oh, what is this madness? What is this madness? There's little birds in the background. It sounds like you have bird world. Right, that needs to turn. What great mechanics, but all oh, I can see, <laughs> I can see that some people have been scratching their head. I am. I 
is this how we do it? You gotta do each bit at a time, very slowly. Oh, 344 again. These levels, they take some time if you don't bomb through them. All right, <laughs> no, no pun intended. Use bombs on enemies. All right, let's give that a go. Uh, okay. Start. All right, so I've collected the bomb, and I drag the bomb. Oh, boom! All right, so this shows that it's not just manage your snake. You also, you've also got to manage the bombs here as well. Oh, died. And that's going to get a bomb there. And theoretically, that has got to be everybody done. There we go, 54 seconds. That's a bit better, isn't it? Use bombs on walls. Now we're playing Bomber Man. Yes. All right. Okay, so it wants us to put a bomb there. Nope, sorry, that way. There, there you go. All right, and where are we? There we are. Alright, so. Strategy time. Alright, we need to get to that bomb clearly, so let's put a bomb there. And we can do that. And get a coin. The blast radius is quite big. So if we put a bomb there, that gives us that bomb to get that coin. We put a bomb here. We go here. The parasites are not doing much at the moment, which is quite good. So one less thing to worry about. Maybe they're just static and sit there looking miserable. All right. Okay. Uh, all right. So we've got one bomb. We've got to get a bomb. We are the bomb. There we go. Oh, no. Hidden coins. New stress. All right. So it's clearly we've got to put one there. we get that one so we want that bomb here and I think now how are we gonna get down to how are we gonna get down to you oh I'll oh, put a bomb there okay did that do anything No. All right, so we failed. We died on a level. Look at the octopus, not very happy. So let's do a retry on that. All right, so this has now got a lot more strategic than what it was before. Um, so, bomb. Let's go this way. Bomb. There. Okay. Get that one. Now, I think a bomb here, here. Yes. So we grab that one and we put another bomb there so we can get that bomb. And we put a bomb here and boom, there we go. What, what did it like? Oh, we didn't... Did we not push the button? Ah, oh, so we exited when we did that, I guess. All right, let's try again. So a bomb here goes there. We grab that. This bomb goes there. And we get that bomb. All right, we are going to put a bomb... Yeah, we've got to be careful here. We'll put a bomb there. So we can grab that coin and do that one. All 
Right, do we need all the bombs? Let's put a bomb there. Okay, somehow that worked. Alright, good, good, good. Alright, so move on. Level 13. <gasps> what is this? Oh, it controls the gates. It's like snake, isn't it? It is like snake. Okay. And we need them to move so we can go through. Oh, I let go of the bloody thing. Keep the mass. Oh no, I didn't let go. It's killing me. It's killing me. All right, so through here, through here, do here. Up here, up here. Do you turn anything? No, you don't. What a stressful game. God, watch him wind backwards. All right, up here. This is a, a unique puzzle game, i got to say. Right, up to the top. I'd have to stop letting go of the bloody mouse. Right, up to the top. Go here, go here, go here. See, right down here. Oh no, we can't, damn it. Yes, don't let go, don't let go. Don't touch the spikes. Whoa. Okay. Ah, this will be an easy one. Look, it's small. Ah, right. So that button locks this spike in place. Thinking, thinking, thinking. Right, let's put the bomb here. Let's see what that does. Okay, that killed that. So I'm assuming it's only one coin to stress about here. Ooh. All right, okay. So now, when that goes up, now locked in place this one here all right now let's put a bomb oh, I did it in the wrong place I must have done that in the wrong place. I should have blown up these. Uh, can we recover from this? Put that there. Down. Hmm. Okay, so let's go pause here. Let's do a restart. Up there, grab that, grab that. It's 
take the bomb and drop it there. There we go. Take the bomb and drop them there. All right, we want to be able to touch that thing at the top. We actually want to be able to get a coin as well. Let's get the coin first. Let's do the coin first. I can't do it. I saw him manipulate the mouse that was sliding off the mouse mat. Right, there we go. So now we just got one more coin. Uh, no, there we go. One more coin to get. Let that one finish its turny turny stuff. There you go. Oh, we did it too slow. Oh, we got to restart. Right, okay, so new fear running out of time. Ha, we did it, we did it, all right. Okay, so we've got a map. So that shows we've done that area, we've done this area. We will play a little bit more. We've got to play a little bit more. What's that? Oh, holy hell. This is going to be big. Let's have a look at this area. So let's do a little bit here. Level one. Don't touch enemies. Ah, that was easy, wasn't it? <laughs> this music sounds very um, apocalyptic western type. Oh, I touched an enemy. They got that done, fortunately. Oh, this is going to be a mad dash down. There we go. No, we didn't do it in time. Is that all right, though? Oh, we can carry on on that one. Use mines on enemy. And it's mines, not mimes. And that octopus has just disappeared, wants us to do this right. All right, so this is where we drag our... Oh. Actually, I'm not sure. Have we just got to use the four mines? Oh, this is easy. Ah, uh, this is just teaching us about the mines. Very easy. Collect and then you can use them all. Perfect, perfect. All right, next one, next one. Oh, we got gas men. Not British gas men, but gas men. Done. Next level. Oh, flames, yes, yes, just what we need now, flames. 
There are so many things this is throwing into the mix. Oh, this is going to be horrible. Oh, right, okay, it does end there. Right, so where does the row above end? Alright, so this turns them off. Okay, just got to get to the top now. Alright, why did I do that? Mother hell! It's easy, all you got to do is do this simple journey. There you go. I thought I was going to be dead on time there. I really did. Use flames on enemy. Oh, okay. Yeah, that sounds good. Okay, the silly fish flew into that. Alright, that's alright. This is going to be a mad rush. Alright, this is going to be a mad rush for the second time. Done! Alright, okay, let's pop back to the shop. So go here, go back to the map, click on the shop. One thousand. 1,000. Alright, let's buy you. And let's buy you. But solid, we're going to buy all the octopuses. We've earned them, we buy them. Right, okay. Easiest shop I've ever seen. Alright, we'll be you. And we'll be you. There we go. And a simple little shop, a nice little shop. Okay, so, we've got this area here. Click on the sign. We've got this area here. It would just be cruel not to, oh, they're locked, they're locked. I said it would have been cruel. Oh my God, how big is this game? Right, okay, well we've left Earth now, so this is where Matt Damien will need to be rescued from. Matt Damien will probably be somewhere among the stars here. But, dear Lord. Alright, what's that plus do there? Bonus levels, okay. Alright, so click on the little uh, chevrons to go down, down, down to where we're allowed to play. This is going to keep you going for a long time, isn't it? Right, okay, while it's doing something, I just, well, where's that? I just want my phone. Where's my phone, damn it? Ah, it's in my pocket. All right, I want to check something here. We are checking something live at the Gentleman's Pixel Club. Uh, da 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 da, or live while I'm recording this video, if this makes sense. So. Damn it. It's not coming up. I did a quick search on my mobile phone because this, this, if this was available on my iPhone, I don't know why it's not coming up. Maybe I spelt it badly. If this is available on my iPhone, you know what? This is going to be a game that I will be getting. Let's do level seven and then we'll call it a day at that point. We'll call it a day at that point. So yes, level seven. All right. So why are they all bleeding like that? I was going to make a really gross joke. Um, but yeah, it's, it's not the right time of month to be making that joke. Um, who knows what's going on with these fish? Who knows what's going on with these fish? I don't like the way they're bleeding like that. It feels wrong. And look at these, we've got the parasites back as well. All right, so this is timing, timing, timing. Good, 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 all right. A 
Okay, another time in one here. When those fish pass. Did we do it? Yes, we did do it. Alright, okay, those two are gone now as well. And I think we've only got one more flame to turn on. Okay, I expected to do something with the green buttons, but maybe not. Use scissors. We weren't going to do any more, but now we've got this. Use scissors on the web. All right. So we've got to get the scissors by going down there and touching that. That was obvious. Oh, no, I died. All right, come on. Oh, no. Oh, gone again. Drag the scissors to the web. Right, that's our exit. Done. There we go. So, I think we'll call it a day at that. You know, time has flown. Oh, holy hell. Over half hour playing this. Over half hour. What can I say? A great, great game. Thank you for pointing this out to me. As I say, this game is cheaper then a couple of bags of these and you can't go far wrong with that you know this is a phenomenal game actually and i am stunned i'm truly stunned by and remember i'm not paid to do this all this is free all this comes out my own money um i'm not i'm I, i'm stunned at the lack of positive reviews the lack of i suppose visibility this has on steam considering it's been out so long and if you go back to the um steam page that i showed you at the beginning you'll see it's continually getting little updates as it goes along as well you know 10 out of 10 for this this game yeah this is absolutely brilliant um if it was available i must have typed it in wrong with whatever phone platform if it's on my phone platform i will be buying this and owning this game all of you stay safe all of you take care and i'll see you in the next video goodbye